Helping now, we're learning more about MGM Resorts' potential plans to settle with victims of the 1 October shooting who are suing the company which owns Mandalay Bay. Documents show the parent company has $751 million of insurance coverage available for a possible settlement payout, but the lawyer for one group of victims telling News 3 tonight they're a long way off from a deal. Heather Mills is here with more. Uh, Jim, lawyers for MGM and the victims, they've already been in negotiations for three months. This new information about potential money for the victims coming from the company's quarterly filing with the SEC. A potential settlement with victims of the 1 October mass shooting, MGM Resorts International informing federal regulators the company believes it is reasonably possible a deal will be reached, that it has, quote, $750 million of insurance coverage available to fund this potential settlement, which the company's insurers have agreed to fund. It is possible a settlement could occur but it's not probable. That from Robert Eglett, an attorney who leads the coalition of plaintiff's lawyers representing 4,200 victims. Three months in, about a year until the statute of limitations expires. If we don't get there by May 15th next year, it's unlikely we're going to get there without restarting litigation. And that means a trial. MGM Resorts International telling News 3 its goal with mediation is, quote, to resolve these matters so that all impacted can move forward in their healing process. Eglitt says both sides have negotiated in good faith, but a settlement is a long way off. There is no deal. It is not a done deal. All right, so as for the litigation of all the cases, and that does include the one that was brought forth by MGM against the victims, Eglitt says they have basically, there's pending motions in all the cases. They've put stays to maybe stop moving them forward, at mm. least for now. MGM, though, saying in this filing that it plans to defend against any lawsuit, and it does believe that it should prevail. So this is something we could see an end as early as next summer or before, or years of litigation. Wow. So complicated with so many different groups of victims being yeah. represented by different attorneys. Mm -hmm. All right, Th Heather, thank, thank you. Thank you for that update.